Hi, this is Marie Elaine, and I have a weekly oracle message for you. Um, now, I remember saying before that anytime you want a message from the universe, just pop along to this weekly um, oracle message playlist, randomly select one, and just be guided to what the universe would like you to know. So today I'm call upon, calling upon these beautiful intuitive oracle cards to um, generate this message. And I have here, guide. Uh, guide spirit helping and guiding through life signs from spirit okay so um, see the image there we are not alone we're always surrounded by um, angelic beings uh, spirit guides higher self whatever label you'd like to give it and it's just being open to receiving this guidance um, we have free will I think we all know this now and these angelic beings or this energy cannot interfere with our choice. So if you open yourself and say, I'm ready, show me, I'd like to be shown the way, then they'll be able to step in. So just tap into that guidance that's on offer and just see if it makes a difference to how things pan out. And the next card we have here is, oh, I love this card. It's autumn and it's actually turning into autumn here where I am. Is a uh, bear wind Christmas stripping away. See what I see this card as. It's like it's an opportunity to release and just see each leaf on a tree as a as a belief that we're hanging on to. And every year we get the opportunity when the seasons roll around to really just start to drop some of those old outdated beliefs. And believe me, we carry many. And just allow ourselves then to take some time to develop new ones and they'll, they'll appear in the spring. They'll start to bud. But it's recognizing what we don't need anymore, what we can let go of, and just allow the universe to take it away. So what have we got here? Third card is, oh, home. Feeling safe, warmth, togetherness, relaxed, time to unwind. Okay. So um, I think that next time you step into your beautiful home, give thanks for the the four walls that protect you, the roof, um, all the loving energy that sits in, within this, the boundaries of our, our space. Because the longer we're in a place, the more energy we leave. It's very important too that if you're actually moving into a new, new dwelling, that you take some um, white sage and you smudge the house to cleanse that environment of the previous tenant's energy because it does linger. Um, just a quick backstory: Someone we knew many years ago moved into um, to a new town, Townsville, moved into a house where the previous occupants had to vacate because he lost his job. And nine months later, the same thing happened to this family that moved in. So just um, it's up to you. You don't need to do that. It's just I like to cleanse the area. So and the final card we have here is oh, we'll go for this one. Oh. Love. Just consider this a sign from the universe. There's some beautiful love coming your way. Heartfelt, passion, unconditional love, togetherness with your partner. So if you're in a relationship and watching this, I feel that you know you're about to just your love is going to deepen. If you're single and looking for love, well then watch out. The signs, the guides from the universe are going to be helping you bump into somebody. And if you're single and happy that way, I think the self-love is going to actually be enhanced. Oh, what a lovely week. So be on the lookout for the guides. Also be prepared to let things drop if you um, feel that way inclined. Um, appreciate your home, what, what you've got, and watch out for that beautiful love that's about to go. Oh. Okay, thank you everyone. Bye.